Hey guys, so we're over at the Sands Hall G, and this is where a bunch of like smaller tech, indie tech companies are, but we found something really cool. This is the Cross Helmet X1, and I'm here with the creator of the model here, and he's gonna tell us a little bit more about the product. Hi, uh, my name is Arata. I'm a founder of the Cross Helmet team. Today, yeah, let's gonna explain about uh, yeah. Cross Helmet, what it is. Yeah. Okay. Can you show? Yeah, do it. Yeah, it's great. Yeah, we are developing actually cross helmets. Um, this is a smart helmet for motorcyclists. It has uh, biggest three features in, in here. First, the back camera and the head-up display. It's cool. built in by the helmet. This back camera captures behind you almost 170 degree. It's a kind of wide angle, kind, okay. kind of GoPro camera lens here. And uh, at the same time, it show up on the heads-up display, always streaming. So when okay. during riding your uh, motorcycle, and then you can check behind you always. That's incredibly useful to have as a rider. And the secondary, that has a Bluetooth and GPS. That okay. means connectivity is yes. our yeah, second feature. And then you have a motor, uh, mobile phone, and you can pair with your phone and pick up music playback and mm -hmm. listen to music or phone call. So many things you can do in yeah. the hands-free. Yeah. yeah, that's super important, obviously, because you can't be on your phone while riding a bike or anything, so. Third, po third point is the sound control system. This mm -hmm. is our patent and technology. Okay. Yeah, when you're riding a motorcycle, it's kind of noisy, it's pretty like annoying experience. That's yeah. why we are de uh, developing the noise cancellation system, okay. our own, and uh, it actually has dynamic sound control system. Okay. It's based on the frequency level you can control by your phone and then suppress your kind of low frequency, suppress um, high frequency level. Yeah. So you can cut out the wind noise or oh. road noise or engine noise and so on. It's dynamically as you want, you can control it. That's because a lot of riders will use earbuds to prevent hearing loss because if you're on a motorcycle for the same periods of time, you can actually start to develop ten, a mild case of tinnitus. So that's super useful. That eliminates the need for disposable earbuds, or earplugs rather. All right, and then one last question for you. Uh, what sort of safety rating will this thing be rocking? Uh, we are planning to get a DOT and a ECE and GIS. Awesome. awesome. Yes, so you're for three of them. Yeah, yeah, mainly US and Europe and Japan. Yeah. yeah. All right, so thank you for your time. I think we're going to demo the product a little bit here, if that's okay? Yeah. All right, cool. Thank you. Huh. All right, this is pretty cool. I can see behind me, it's very smooth, actually. It's very clear picture, and it doesn't take my eye, and I kind of just see it in my peripheral vision. It doesn't take my eyes off the road or anything, so that's really useful. How comfy is it? It is incredibly comfy, I gotta tell you. So this is a, has a little bit of modularity to it, right? So you can make it go, instead of a three-quarter helmet, you can make it go full face right there? Yes. Okay. Actually, this is kind of for the sh show. It's yeah. with a chin chingar, right. just temporarily. Yeah. So usually we uh, yeah, launching as a full face type. Okay, L. that's awesome. And then you can re replace the visors out, correct? Yes, yes, okay. correct. All so, right. Yeah. Generally, we are using a transparent one, yeah. but uh, as you want, just change to the, this tinted one. Okay. Could you connect two of these things natively to each other without the phone, or no? Kind of like a Senna system? Um, right now, we are actually developing like right okay. now. Okay. Yeah. Working on it. Our concept, yes. Okay. Um, actually, yeah. yes. All right. So that's very cool. Uh, do you have an estimated price for this thing? Yeah. Uh, fine. Right now, it's pre-order. We are getting pre-order on Indiegogo. Okay. And that price is 1600 Okay. And finally, in the retail store, going to be a seventeen ninety-nine US dollar. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Finally. Yeah. All right. And then when do you hope to make it to market with this? March. March. That's March. Yeah. Yeah. Already, we have started uh, uh, mass production process. Oh wow. Yeah. So you and guys are really far along. Yeah, yeah, I think so. And uh, almost so. March, we're gonna set up uh, almost, and then we probably retail to the retail launch at the retailer uh, April to Ma uh, to May. Okay. And in the first place, we're gonna go to the U.S. market first. Uh -huh. Yeah. So okay. yeah, you can see it on May. Yeah. Yeah.
this is, you know, this is a great product so far from what you've just shown me. It's like, I've seen a lot of uh, stuff surrounding other, like, smart helmets that have been attempted and everything, mm -hmm. but I mean, this is just, this is really well thought yeah, this out. Yeah, definitely everything. Yeah, this is this actually is a product. Like, yeah. this is a full, tangible product. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. All right. So, thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much. I really much. appreciate it. Yeah, I appreciate it. It's very cool. Thank you. Thank you.